Hey, what's happening, everybody? Um, it's two bass players that need recognition, and you probably don't never heard of them. First one is James Jamison. James Jamison was with the Funk Brothers to play with Motown. He was a bad dude. When you think of any Motown song and you hear that bass, it's this guy. And the sad thing is, is that he died in 1983 and a lot of people don't even know who he is. When you hear Reach Out and Bernadette and Standing in the Shadows of Love, you hear that bass, I'm just waiting for the heartaches to come. And all the Supreme songs, Love Child. All the Jackson 5 songs, all the Temptation songs, you know, you hear that bass line, that's this guy. That's James Jameson. He died basically unknown. And the funny thing is, is that, is that, um, Is that I was reading about him, and um, that's his son too. He had a son named James Jameson Jr., and he looks just like his dad. He's playing the bass, carrying that tradition. But anyway, I was reading about James Jameson, and um, <clears throat> it led me to this other lady. I was re um. Her name is Carol K. That's her, Carol K. And I never heard of her. I'm like, damn, who is this? And I, and I, I, I tell you what, you may not have never heard of her, but I guarantee you, you know her music. This lady's awesome. She was a looker too back in the day. That's her when she was younger. But this lady played with all kinds of people. That's her right there back in the day. She played with Sonny and Shad, Beach Boys. Uh, that's her right there, Carol K. She played with all kinds of people. She played with Beach Boys, Phil Spector, uh, The Doors, Richie Valens, Frank Sinatra, Nancy Sinatra, Glenn Campbell. This lady did TV shows, theme shows she did. I was reading, she did... Uh, Good vibrations. She did a lot of stuff, man. Like old TV shows back in the day, like Mannix and Mission Impossible. So anyway, I'm gonna put a link to a couple of these videos. Like, but once again, Carol K. and James Jameson. That's him right there. Peace. Check them out.